Can't you understand? see Jackie Weaver. Oh, I'm so sorry, Madam Acting Chairwoman. Do carry on. Thank you very much, Mrs. Ledbetter. I call this extraordinary meeting of the Music Society to order. I still think it is unconstitutional and indeed underhanded to hold an election while Miss Munshaft is on holiday in Greece. <laughs> <laughs> May I reply? Do learn your society's rules, Mr. Chipchase. There are sufficient members here to form a quorum. It is perfectly legal. Yes. I yes, still sir. think it's unfair to Miss Munchart. Yes. I don't see why. You seem more than an adequate mouthpiece for her. Well, as I seem to have the floor, there are just one or two remarks I should like to make. Firstly, I did not seek office. It is simply that I seem to have been chosen as the standard bearer for those of us who seek to put a more professional gloss on our production. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now, let me touch on Dolly Munshaft for a moment. Here we go. Vilification. No, Mr. Chipchase. Admiration. No one is more aware than I of how much Dolly Munshaft has put into this society. And no one is more aware of the awful toll it has taken on her general health, her nerves, and her voice. Fuck off. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if at this moment Dolly were not sitting in some taverna with her bottle of ouzo, almost wishing that she loses this election. She doesn't even know about it. And if I am chosen to take up the tiller of our little ship, I shall do so humbly, and in so doing, I shall call upon all of you to wish dear Dolly a happy harbour in the back row of the chorus. Where are you going, Jerry? I take charge. <laughs>